Next type of operator is membership operator, which is used to check or validate the membership of a value. Means we are checking here uh, whether the particular value or element item is present in the given sequence or not. So there are two types of membership operators in and not in. In operator is used to check whether the given sequence or the character substring or element exist in a current given sequence or not. It evaluates to if it finds the specified element in a sequence otherwise it results in false. So for example in this list 1 to 5 numbers are present and if we check 3 in list 1 so 3 is present in this particular list so it results in true suppose we write 7 in list 1 so that 7 is not present in the list so it results in false next operator is not in operator which evaluates to if the given sequence is not present in the given value is not present in the sequence otherwise it returns the false so 7 not in list 1 so 7 is not present so it results in true if we write 3 not in list 1 3 is present so it results in false and the last type of operator is identity operator identity operators are used to compare two objects if both the objects are actually same along with the data type and it shares the same memory location and there are two types of uh, identity operators is and not is not so is evaluates true if the variables on either side mean both the variables are same objects otherwise it results in false so x equals to 5 y equals to 5 so if we write x is 5 both are pointing to the same value if we write x equals to 5 then x equals to y both are pointing to the same value so x is y results in true if both are pointing to different values then it results in false is not operator it evaluates true if both variables are not in same objects so x equals to we have one list and y equals to another list and we have assigned z equals to x so the same memory location is assigned to variable x or uh, that is variable z so x is not z results in false and x is not y results in true so we will see the example of it so if we consider any list l1 equals to some values and if we write 3 in this l1 it results in true if we write 3 not in l1 it results in false if we write 10 not in list 10 is not present so it results in true and identity operator if we create one more variable containing the same values so if we write l1 is l2 it results in false because l1 and l2 are two different objects and if we create l3 equals to l1 and now we will write l3 is l1 it results in true because both are sharing the same memory same for the x and y variable if x equals to 2 and y equals to 2 if we write x is y it results in true these two integers are pointing to the same value and uh, is not if we write l2 is not l1 because they are not sharing the memory so it results in true and if it is we write l2 itself then it results in false because l2 and l2 are same or l3 is not l1 so it results in false so these are the membership and identity operators in python so this is all about the python operators we have seen all type of python operators thank you